Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. I hope you all are fine and staying safe and happy at your homes. I am your GK teacher, Ms. Farheen, and I welcome you all to your GK class. So, my dear students, as you know that we have started unit number 12, and I have given you a complete introduction of this unit. So, quickly, let's uh, revise the name of our unit. The Natural Environment and Resources. The Natural Environment and Resources. So, today is its first lesson. Let's quickly look at some pictures. But before looking at this picture, my dear students, look around you and uh, tell a few living things and non-living things in your surroundings. For example, in my room, I can see a chair, a table, an LCD, a board, and these are all non-living things. And I am a living thing. I am the only living thing in this room. So, look around yourself now and tell a few living things and non-living things around you. Very nice. First, tell me the non-living things. Very good. Now tell me a few living things. You are a living thing. And can you see a plant, a flower or a pet or an animal around you? Very good. So now let's have a look at the picture and point out some living things first in this picture. I will circle all the living things. First look at the frog. Is it a living thing? Yes, it is a living thing. This is a cow. Is it living or non-living? This is a living thing. Then I can see a rat here. It is also living. Flowers, these plants, trees. This tree, this tree, these are all living things that I can see in this picture. Now, let's tick, put a tick on all the non-living things. Now, let's quickly see water. Is it living or non-living? It is non-living thing. Then you can see the sun. It is non-living. Clouds, non-living. Rocks, they are also non-living. And I can see some soil or uh, this is also non-living. So, we have pointed out some living and non-living things. Aapko yaad hai na, humne padha hai non-living things kya hote hain or living things kya hote hain. Again, let's have a look at this picture. It is a desert. It is a desert. Now, let's point out, let's circle all the living things. This camel, it can move, it can grow, it can breathe. So, this is a living thing. Then the plants, this grass, this tree, these are all living things. Now, let's put a tick on the non-living things. This is non-living thing, this mountain, this soil, these are all non-living things. And maybe some rocks which we can see, which we cannot see here. They are all non-living things. Now, again, let's look at this picture. This is a forest. Now, let's again circle all the living things. I can see a lot of elephants and small goats here. Let's circle them. The elephants and the animals are all living things. Let's put a circle, lots of circles. Then the grass and the plants, trees, they are all living things. And the soil, the rocks, water, these are all non-living things. Okay? So, my dear students, now in this picture you can see that this is a natural environment. And this is a man-made environment. And you can see a lot of things there. The water is non-living. The rocks are non-living. The plants are living. And in this picture, you can see the buildings are non-living. They are man-made. Then there are small houses. They are also non-living. Uh, some cars, 
they are also non living water so these are living and non living things so jo cheeze insano ne banayi hai wo man made hoti hai aur jo cheeze naturally hamare environment mein milti hai jaise ki rocks soil plants animals these are all natural things okay to bahut si jitni bhi living things hain wo sab natural hoti hain non living things jo hai they can be man made or natural jaise ki rocks soil water air sun clouds they are all natural things pencil bottle chair buildings houses they are all man made things okay to humne in do pictures mein ye bhi dekh liya now my dear students let's quickly revise again properties of living things humne padh liya living things kya the to living things kya kya karte hain ki hum unko living kehte hain they move they breed they grow they reproduce that means they have babies they eat and they drink so these are all the properties of living things now let's move towards the properties of non living things non living things kya karte hain they do not move they do not breed they do not grow they do not reproduce do not eat and do not drink so These are the properties of non-living things. ठीक है तो अब हम पढ़ने जा रहे हैं about के हमारे environment में natural environments जो है जैसे कि river, jungle, forest, uh, desert, इनके अंदर कौन कौन सी living और non-living things होते हैं Okay? Now let's have a look at the student learning outcome on page number 85. And after the uh, by the end of today's lesson, all the students will be able to recognize that natural and my environment comprises of living and non-living things. जितने भी natural environment हैं जो अल्लाह ताला ने बनाए हैं जैसे कि forest, rivers, deserts, उनके अंदर वो किन चीजों से मिलके बनते हैं? They are made collectively made up of living and non-living things. Okay, my dear students, let quick let's quickly look at the Islamic perspective. It is God who made the earth for you to settle and the heavens as a canopy. He designed you and perfected your design and provided you with wholesome things, such as God, your Lord. So blessed be God, Lord of the worlds. So Allah Taala Quran e Pak me keh rahe hain ki Allah Taala ne ye puri dunya banayi hai. Allah Taala ne hamare upar jannat banayi hai, asman banaya hai, niche zameen banayi hai. हमें बनाया है अल्लाह ताला ने एनिमल्स और ट्रीज को बनाया है तो जो अल्टीमेट क्रिएटर है सब चीजों का वो कौन है इट इज अल्लाह ताला ओके और हमें अल्लाह ताला के ऊपर बहुत ज्यादा जो है वो अल्लाह ताला की तारीफ करनी चाहिए सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स क्विकली लुक एट द प्री रीडिंग क्वेश्चन क्विकली आंसर अफ यू क्वेश्चन वट आर नॉन लिविंग थिंग्स विच के नॉट मूव ब्रीद ग्रो drink or eat what are living things living things can grow reproduce move talk drink walk so these are the properties of living things now tell plants are living or non living things plants kya hai because they do not move aapne kabhi unhe khana bhi nahi khate hue dekha but what do you think are they living or non living plants are living things very good because they grow they breed they reproduce so that's why they are living things flow water flows from its place is it living or non living water ek jagah se dusri jagah move karta hai flow karta hai now tell me is it living or non living it is non living very good why because it does not breathe grow drink eat or reproduce very good now my dear students quickly open page number 86 in your books pause the video and open the page i hope everybody has opened the page look at the picture you can see a natural environment here you can see water grass a two cows here clouds and sun so this is a natural environment there are different things here and we can see that water is non living cow is living plants are living rocks and soil are non living 
sun and clouds are also non-living so this is a natural environment which is made up of both the things living and non-living okay now let's put your fingers where i will read and focus on all the important words we will start the reading natural environment natural environment things around us make our environment it includes both living and non-living things non-living things may be natural or humans have made them for their benefit so the environment consisting of living and all natural non-living things is called the natural environment is called the natural environment again focus on this as a environment jiske under living things ho or jo non-living things ho they must be natural man-made nahi honi chahiye they combine and make natural environment living things in the natural environment include birds animals insects humans and plants whereas air water soil rocks etc are non-living but natural things okay now is it clear natural things some of the natural environments are forests, rivers, mountains, deserts. So my dear students, we have read a lot of things in this lesson. I have already explained you at the start of the activity. We have started the lesson, so we have done the activity. I have shown you the different natural environments. All were made by the God. Nothing was human made. So, all the things which are in a natural environment and they may be non-living things. Living things to hote hi natural hai. So, the non-living things which like air, water, sun, soil, stones are natural but non-living things. Okay? And collectively non-living things, natural non-living things and living things make up your natural environment. ठीक है ऐसा एनवायरनमेंट जिसमें कुछ भी मैन मेड नहीं है एवरीथिंग इज मेड अप ऑफ नेचर और बाय गॉड इज कॉल्ड अ नेचुरल एनवायरनमेंट ओके नाउ वी विल मूव फॉरवर्ड एंड यू विल हैव अ क्लियर लुक सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स टीचर्स नोट हियर शो स्टूडेंट्स फ्लैश कार्ड्स ऑफ नेचुरल एनवायरनमेंट्स मेंशनड इन द बुक ठीक है अब आपको मैं फॉरेस्ट रिवर माउंटेन्स और डेजर्ट्स की कुछ पिक्चर्स दिखाती हूँ है यू कैन सी है यू कैन सी अ ग्रास लैंड माउंटेन्स एंड फॉरेस्ट लॉट्स ऑफ ट्रीज दिस इज नेचुरल ऑल नेचुरल है यू कैन सी द रिवर ग्रास एंड माउंटेन्स सॉरी नो माउंटेन्स ट्रीज लॉट्स ऑफ ट्रीज एंड प्लांट्स एंड सम माउंटेन्स हेयर so this is also natural environment now my dear students we will move towards your practice so for that you will open page number 96 in your books also take out your notebooks and we will do question number one from your writing practice you can see question number one on your screen classify the following objects in live into living and non-living Mountain, rose plant, soil, monkey, bag, pen, mobile phone and sparrow. So my dear students, you can see some things which are given to you. In your copy, you will make a column like this in which you will write living on one side and non-living on uh, other side. Can you see it? Everybody can see it on the screen. Okay, now I will do the first one for you and you will do the rest by yourself in your notebooks. So, the living thing. Is mountain a living thing? No, it is not. So, it will come in non-living. Very good. Now, rose plant. Plants are living. So, rose plant will come under 
living. So this is how you will uh, sort out the rest of the things given to you into living and non living and you will finish this work in your notebook. I hope everybody has finished it. Now we will move forward towards your worksheet my dear students. You will write down your name and your class on the worksheet and your teacher will provide you a printed worksheet like this. And my dear students, the directions are given to you. Look at the pictures and fill in the blanks with words given. Also write it is living or non-living. So my dear students, here some natural things from the natural environment are given to you in the box. Water, rocks, plants, animals, air and soil. We will and you can also see the pictures here. So you have to accordingly fill it in. So the first one, you can see the picture. It is water. So, water will come here and is it living or non-living? It is non-living. So, this is how you will do it. Okay. Now, the next one, you can see a zebra here. So, it is an animal. So, animal will come here. And animals are living or non-living? Living. They are very nice. So, this is how you will finish the rest of the worksheet. Sort the things uh, out uh, with the help of the pictures and the word box and also tell they are living or non-living. Finish the worksheet. I hope everybody has finished it. We will move forward towards your evaluation. Quickly answer some questions given on page number 94 is your listening and speaking assessment. We will do question number 1 till question number 4. So you can see the questions here. Question number 1. Which things make our environment? Environment is made up of living things and non-living things. Very good. Now, question number two, what is natural environment? What is natural environment? Yes, living things and all the natural non-living things, they make up our natural environment. Which things are included in natural environment? Yes, Le uh, animal, uh, living things like animals, human beings, plants and non-natural non-living things like air, sun, rocks, clouds, water, mountains. These are all natural non-living things and they make up our natural environment. Question number four on your screen. Which non-living things are included in natural environment? Quickly tell, I've just told you. Natural non-living things. Natural non-living things. Yes, quickly tell. Very good. Mountains, rocks, soil, sun, clouds, air, water. Very good. So, my dear students, from here we will move forward towards your homework. Quickly look at the homework given on page number 86. Is your home activity number one? Observe your home and make a list of five non living but natural things. आपने अपने घर को ऑब्जर्व करना है और आपने नॉन लिविंग थिंग्स के नेम जो है अपनी नोटबुक में नोट डाउन करने हैं बट दे मस्ट बी नेचुरल नॉट मैन मेड लाइक पेन बॉटल वॉल्स दीज आर ऑल नॉन लिविंग थिंग्स बट दे आर मैन मेड सो द थिंग्स यू विल नोट डाउन मस्ट बी नॉन लिविंग नेचुरल थिंग्स ओके सो फिनिश इट अप एंड वी विल मूव फॉरवर्ड so today is wrap up my dear students. Now all of you know that an environment made up of all natural things is called natural environment. Living and natural non-living things are components of the natural environment. So my dear students, I hope you have enjoyed the lecture. You have learned a lot of things about living things and non-living things. Keep everybody around you safe. Have a good day and Allah Hafiz.